Today we're gonna work on chair game. So chair game pattern is um, chair as um, you know object, obvious object there, and then it dog can say if um, either you are using this in your class or in a dog show, um, you can use a chair. You will have a chair as a prop, and the dog can say it in distance. So this game is um, a way for the dog to look at me that trigger me to go back to a chair and I drop a treat on the chair, wait for a dog to look at me again and it will walk away from a chair and then repeat the pattern. That's just Nico's first session and then let's give it a try. Okay, I'm gonna first start with drop some treats on the chair. I will wait. Yes! And I walk away, drop a treat, wait, yes! Now we add a fake dog as a trigger and then to add a little bit more difficulty for this game. Let's give it a try. <laughs> nice, he already goes, knows to go back to the chair. You're very good. You think I want you to target? Good boy. Yes. Yes. Good boy. You're so good. Yes. Very good. Um, now I replace the fake dog with a, a robot, a robot vacuum. This is new. We just got it. We use it once, and Nico still a little bit scared of it. So I'm gonna use it for this session. Great. <laughs> oh, you don't have it. Oh yeah, good. Okay. Good boy. You can move away. Yes. 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 Where you place the treats. Depends on your dog's response. The closer to the trigger, the harder. Good boy. Yes, very good. Yes. Good job. Yes, good boy. Yes, good. So he checking out the vacuum, he decided it's okay, we go back to the chair. Nice. 